Hey there, thank you for joining me uh, in this video. This is a new kind of video that we're trying out, so hopefully this will work out pretty well. Um, and the, the first video that I wanted to put out on the channel uh, is a devotional practice that I've been introduced to more recently that's been super helpful for me, especially if I've been going into a more stressful time. This has been so helpful for me, and I wanted to uh, encourage all of us to give it a try, um, especially with how stressful everything is. We can go ahead and try a, a practice that might prove helpful, um, but I think it could be really good. It could be a good way of reframing how we look at our entire day. It's a, it's a different type of prayer, um, or it could be said meditation, um, and it's called Palms Up, Palms Down, which is actually backwards for the way that we're going to be doing this. Um, about, that's what it's called, Palms Up, Palms Down. And what we're going to do is we're going to uh, walk through all the things that we have going on. Um, and first we're going to walk through it, Palms Down. Palms Down signifying that we're releasing something. We are going to give something up with everything that we mentioned. And it can be anything that you're going to talk about. Um, one day that I did this, um, I was going to have to have our daughters all day. It was going to be a stressful day. I had a number of appointments and I needed to just say that I'm giving up a lot of this stuff. I'm giving up a lot of the control over it. I'm going to give up any anger that I'm going to have. I'm going to give up my frustration. Maybe you know that you're going to get in contact with someone during that day that's just going to frustrate you and stress you out, and you need to give that up. You need to give that relationship up. Maybe you have high hopes and it's making you extremely nervous, and you need to give those nerves away. Maybe you need to give away control over something that's going to happen. Or maybe you just need to place the event in God's hands. Uh, you might not know why you're placing this event in God's hands compared to another, but maybe you just say, okay, I know I have uh, several different things that will happen during this day, and I'm going to place them in God's hands. I'm going to palms down. I'm going to go palms down with those things. Then you go palms up, and you're going to go back through your day, and you will probably rename everything else that you've named. Uh, you are probably going to get all of the same worries and frustrations you will probably give, all of the same events that are going to happen throughout your day, but this time you are going to name the things that you believe you need to receive from God. So with uh, with my daughters, uh, going through that whole day, I was like, God, please give me patience. Please um, give me mercy. Give me grace and love that I can not get frustrated with how off the wall my daughters are. Um, and that was palms up. Give me those things. And so I want uh, to do a palms up, palms down meditation, um, looking at the things that are going on right now, things that are going on. I know a number of you that will see this are part of my churches. A lot of you who are seeing these videos are probably a part of a church. Um, and we'll, we'll, we'll put that, almost every church is having to, cancel at least in-person services. Um, and so we'll, we'll put that, palm, palms up, palms down. Um, schools being canceled. Uh, for any of you who are parents who end up on this channel, we will be putting that there. Um, just all of the medical stuff that's happening, uh, that'll be part of it. All of the economic things that are going on, uh, that will be part of it as well. Um, so uh, I'm going to, to demonstrate what palms up, palms down could look like, and um, I'm not going to name any personal things I have going on today, um, but I'm going to lead us all in a type of palms up, palms down over the stuff that is happening. So uh, please join with me in prayer. We're going palms down. Dear God, Right now, we give up our anxiety. We give up our fear. God, we give up our 
worry over the many things we have no control over. We cannot control this virus that's spreading. God, we give that up. We cannot control the economy. We, we give that up. We cannot control what will happen with our churches over the next couple weeks. God, we give that up. We cannot control what will happen in our own houses. God, we give that up. We cannot control what will happen with the schools. We cannot control what will happen with major events that will be coming up. We do not have control over it. We give those things up, God. God, we give up our desire to prove ourselves right and our opinions on what is happening. We don't know what's going on. We don't know how this virus got started. We don't know what government regulations are going to do and what next step needs to be taken. God, we, we give that up. We do not know. We are not all-knowing. We are not all-seeing in the things that are happening. We give this up. Now we go palms up. God, please give me patience as we are quarantined in, as we cannot do the things we want to do, as we have to deal with people who can be very hard to deal with even though they live in our own house. God, give us patience as we have to wait out this virus. Give us patience as we see the news give us peace as we see the news and what's going on give us peace as we look at the economy and we don't know what this means for us in the future give us peace god provide for us as many of us are feeling heavily hit as some of us don't have jobs to go to as some of us are really struggling financially right now god Please provide for us. Please give us peace. God, please give us wisdom and discernment that we will hear so many theories about the things that are going on that only you truly know. Please help us only look for the truth from you. God, please give us the love and grace to care for each other well in this trying time. Please give us the wisdom to know how to best take care of ourselves and others during a very trying time. God, please give us health and healing during this pandemic. Please give to the medical professionals the wisdom and insight that they're going to need to create a cure. Most of all, God, please give us your continued presence. Please help us feel Jesus present with us. Please help us feel the Holy Spirit filling us with love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Please fill us with the love of the Father. Amen. Thank you for joining me. I hope I was encouraging to you. I would encourage you to use that kind of meditation uh, maybe multiple times a day, maybe just once a day every day as we're going through what will be a very difficult time. Thank you again for joining me. God bless you.